Heather. I could have handled. Oh, but the car. You know, it's really your girlfriend's fault if you think about it. Well, both of yours. If you hadn't started this project, she'd still be alive, wouldn't she? Heather would still be alive. Not Heather Ross. I mean, she's been dead for some time. No, I'm talking about your dead girlfriend in the trunk. And all this time, I thought her name was Q. Oh, I had a hell of a time trying to track her. Thought I was losing my touch. And then I realized Q was short for Quinn. Heather Abigail Quinn. <laughs> you know, after all your obsessing over who killed Heather, in the end, lo and behold, it was you. <laughs> I'll fucking kill you. Uh, me? No. Her? In cold blood, I'm afraid. There you go. How does it feel to have murdered your girlfriend? Probably exactly the same way Sean feels. You son of a bitch! You, you two have so much in common. Ah, <laughs> oh, your suspicions were correct. Urso's not your Waverly Butcher. He's not even worthy of being my victim. But hey, it's not every day you find somebody who actually wants to be a patsy. What is this big power on? No, 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 no. You had your chance. I told you to go to the art museum. Now, shoot yourself. Come on. You can do it. Oh, no, no. I wouldn't, really wouldn't do that. Now go ahead. Shoot yourself. No. I'm not going to do it. Do it. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> you are so heroic. You know, I saw a little of myself in you. And then you got too deep. Couldn't keep your girlfriend happy. Couldn't keep your best friend happy. Couldn't solve the case. Ah, oh, come on. I told you obsession was gonna lead to pain, heartbreak, and hurt. I have to admit, I'm a little sad about you. You're like a measly little rat, a rodent, scurrying around, thinking you're safe, hiding in the dark from the owl. That's not your fault. It's just life. Either you're a predator or you're prey. You're an owl or you're a rat. Fuck you. Be a good little rat and pull that trigger. You're gonna have to kill me yourself. Fine. You don't need to look at this right now. I'm so sorry, Max. I mean, they're dead. Both of them. I mean, I could have, I could have figured this out sooner. I mean, it's all my fault. Don't say that. It's not your fault. The only thing you're guilty of was being a good friend to both of them. They knew that. Andrew knew that. I just. 
I don't know what to do anymore. You need to finish it. What? This. I think you should turn in the project. For them. For you. I don't know anything about editing. But you know everything about your friends. I'm all alone now. No, you're not. 